hello everyone, I'm Daniel for BU for you gaming and today we are back in Lens Island. So let's see if we can get this and let's go over here a little bit so we don't cut down these. Okay, so now I did cut these down right before I went to sleep, but I figured I would like to plant them in the morning. So there we go. I don't think there's anything else here that we can uh, have straight now. Uh, so let's go back in here. We are going to plant roses again. We are going to go in here and plant uh, the marigolds, right? And then this was a lavender. So now we have that growing. We have these look like they're going to be ready soon. Uh, these might be ready in the morning. And uh, these look like they're also going to be ready soon. Mm, okay. And then we are just going to quickly go over here and uh, do this. So I don't remember if I mentioned this in the last video, but... Um, in the video before that, I ended up dying in a dungeon, right? And I was like, ah, oh, man, there's no way of saving. But I think that it actually is. I think it's just because you exit the game when you save that I kind of just th thought there wasn't. But we're going to have to test it out, of course, when we go back into the dungeon. But I can't really remember if I, I have saved in the dungeon so far at any point. But you should be able to just save the menu and then jump back into the game but i don't know if it's gonna like force you to the front of the dungeon again or if it's gonna reset all the spawners or something in the same way as when you enter the dungeon right because that's how it works in some games if you try to save inside a dungeon or something then it kind of just when you load the game back up it just puts you back at the front right uh, but we're gonna have to test if we can do that. I don't actually remember if I've done that in so far I actually saved while I was in there um, But the only annoying thing would be that if you have to run around and do that in the dungeon to avoid losing all your stuff, right? Is that you um, Is that you have to go out to the menu every time it would be nice if there was a way that you could kind of you know put little waypoints or you know, just or checkpoints, just save every now in the dungeon so you don't have to go all the way back. But of course, if it sets you back to the front of the dungeon, it can save you the running back if you've gone very far into the dungeon and then you're like, okay, I just want to go home. Then you could just save and load the game again, right? And then you would be back at the front instead of having to run all the way back. But I don't know how it works. I don't remember, really don't remember if we have saved in there. But there we go. We got all this planted right. I got it all watered. That should be fine. So we are going to go in here. Check that I have. There's my axe. I've switched these two around. And then I am going to bring this with me. Yes. And let's, let's make sure to eat a little bit. There we go. How many do I have? I actually only have the 18 that are right here. Mm, okay. Well, that's fine. Then I wanted to go in here and I want to make this because I've been cooking up some more uh, iron and uh, running around doing some mining and stuff. I also went and sold a batch of like a full batch, 250 clay. It actually only gives you 40 coins. So I was pondering if maybe it would be worth it to, let's craft this, if it would be worth it to just melt it all down here and then sell the sapphires. But I couldn't remember where we, where we might be able to buy or sell those. I couldn't really see them when I just made a quick pick stop, pit stop into the uh, town. But I don't know, maybe it's worth it to melt all the clay down, get sapphires and sell those instead. Even though it's going to cost you either wood, or, either wood or coal or both. And of course the... Um, the clay itself, but then you would have to compare the prices and all that. Yes, for now I just tried to sell a batch of this. Um, let's grab you. Let's just, I don't know if we ever, well we do pick some of this up. Let's just leave it in here. Uh, because I don't really need glass right now and I do have 144. But at least now we are going to have... Um, doo -doo -doo. Uh, did I not just craft the battle axe it's here um but why is it not here oh do we have to have an up a level tree before i can that doesn't make sense or oh, did i not all oh, right i have to go in there that's all the stuff i have to craft <laughs> 
<laughs> man, the system in this game, it m some people might enjoy it, but I actually find this very, very confusing. I would much rather just have a separate like chest or something and put my stuff in there and have to pull it out and have a normal like big toolbar and all that stuff because I find this so confusing. <laughs> I don't know why, but I just do. Uh, let's try and put you down here. So this one does 11 to 18. Uh, <laughs> just start swinging and you'll surely hit something. Okay, so 11 to 18 compared to 12 to 14. So the max, the minimum is actually higher for this, but the max is, um, is higher. And then this one does 16 to 18 compared to 15 to 32. Wow. It does also do has like an ability. I don't quite know what the deal is with the abilities. How do you use the abilities? Um, and then this has speed average, not back average. This has speed average, which is what I was looking for. Maybe something a little fat or that isn't high like this. And then it has a high knockback. But how do I use... Oh, okay, Q. Okay, I guess I have to be somewhere where I can actually hit an enemy because Q doesn't do anything right now. So I'm not sure how that works or if it's something that isn't implemented yet or something. Maybe I have to be in a dungeon to be able to use it. I don't know, but we're going to try and bring that into the dungeon, and um, yeah, that's going to be the plan. That's going to be my plan, and as you can see, I've plopped down my bed here, and now, of course, things are deciding that they want to be watered. So let's just quickly do that. At least that resets every time you pull it out of this, so <laughs> that is a bit nice. Okay, so now they are all watered. Yes. Cool. Oh, okay. Go in here. And what did I have here? No, I just have my blueberries. Let's put you down here. Cool. But before we go into the dungeon, I don't know if we're going to get to that today. I noticed when I was running around uh, trying to get some stuff. Oh, more stone has respawned after I slept a little bit. Uh, I ran past here earlier and there wasn't any stone, but now it has respawned. So... Let's just grab a bit of it and this. Okay, and then we are going to head up this way. If I can find my way back because I was running around mining and cutting down some trees because we're going to need 80, 80 wood, if I remember correctly, to fix that bridge in the dungeon. Yeah, so I wanted to make sure I had some of that. And then somewhere up here, I have water here and then kind of up in this corner somewhere, I noticed... A, a, a place I think we haven't been to. I don't recall having... Maybe I, maybe you have. We're gonna go see. I didn't want to go over there without you guys. But I just have this feeling we've been there before. We've definitely been over here. Uh, how far up do I have to go? Um, yeah, I'm not quite sure if I've gone too... Yeah, I've, I think I've gone too far. I've gone too far. We have to go down further this way. Hmm... Um, just felt like it was kind of in a corner. Maybe it's when we go around this way. Do I just kind of crossed kind of down towards home and uh, because it was dark and I wanted to go and empty out stuff. Yeah, here. We haven't been out here, have we? I don't recall having been out here. Let's just make sure to have a weapon with us in case there's anything like there was with the other one. Oh, look at that. Nice. Okay, so... Or you do a double hit just by one hit. I just click one time. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Nice. Well, let's go over here. I don't think we've been over here. Oh, no, 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 no. We haven't been over here. Look at this. <gasps> the sandstone altar. Ooh, yeah. <gasps> oh, oh, oh. Oh, what is that? <gasps> oh, I'm not sure I should be up here yet. Am I ready to deal with anything that... Uh, I don't think I am. Okay, let's just <laughs> take a little little chill pill right here. Because I am... Oh man, that looks terrifying. I'm gonna die, guys. I'm definitely gonna die here. I can feel it. Probably gonna walk right up to it and get a one... Like, get one shot. Look at that beast. Oh man. Um... Okay, let's let's save. At least I know here that we can... Oh, right, save the menu. But <laughs> see, this is what I was like. Then you have to kind of jump back in again. 
But at least now I know that I've saved right there. But I don't know if you can do this in the dungeon. That's the question. Uh, let's actually... Let's just get a little view of this. Because I kind of want to have a view of it before we... Oh, look at that. Wow, look at that thingy. <gasps> oh, and there's even more stuff over there. I wonder if there's more of them. I hope not. Oh, this is going to go so bad. <laughs> Well, I guess we are just gonna jump straight into it and... Oh, yikes. Oh no, oh no. Uh, well, I still don't seem to have any kind of a ability I can use there. Oh man, I'm afraid I'm gonna be... Oh, I'm afraid I'm gonna be like one... Oh wow, it does stop twice the damage as the big guys in the dungeon because they, they do eight. And this guy do, does, oh look at that, it does 15, wow, and it's really, uh, okay, I'm not quite sure if, <laughs> oh, if I should have gone here. Okay, we definitely have to, like, hit and move away. Okay, move away, oh, you also have, like, a rage attack or something like that, oh no, you did it again, you hit me again. Can I take this? I have no idea if I can, Ooh. It, it, it kind of attacks me too soon that I can manage to do one of these. Okay. See, then it's actually not until then. Oh, I got it. I got it. Look at that. <gasps> and we got three. <gasps> nice. Okay, but it's because I have to click and then... Yeah, so there and then... Oh, I have to like do tries, of course, because instead of clicking there, I have to actually do it at the second time, if I want to do a critical hit. Okay. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. Oh, boy. I don't know if there's any... I don't know if there's any... Uh, let's just spend a little time mining here. <laughs> I don't know if there are any brazels here, but it doesn't seem like it. I think it's maybe supposed to be that you go here later when you're a little bit tougher and have a better weapon i don't know or just at, or that you're just better at combat than me i don't feel like my health is going up at all at the moment i feel like it did in the dungeon even if we're not standing next to a brazier see it's just stuck at 35 so maybe you can't like heal here without food hmm Okay, well, I guess we're gonna do this. And then we're gonna try and go around this way a little bit. Can I get this? I would love to get this. Oh, I would love, love that too. I just wanna see how many there are here so I don't suddenly have two of them. And might be good. Oh, this is a big one. Uh, let's just try and deal with this little one. There we go. Cool. Ooh. Okay, I was kind of expecting to find one of those. Oh, I'm full on limestone. Let's not break this. Um, I was kind of expecting to find a place like the other place where we just had like a bit of ruins and two of these little dudes. And then, oh no, you sniffed me out. Um, okay, let's just go kind of over here. And then, are you bigger than the other one? Oh man, I hope not. Okay. Yep. Oh, that. Whoa, wow. <laughs> oh, this is... Oh, you, well, are you going to cut down some trees for me? That would be nice. You do seem very, very aggressive. It can do double attacks, too. Oh, man. Did you guys notice that? It kind of looked like the trees were actually shaking when it was rowing. Okay. Oh, no, I failed. I was trying to do a... Nope. <laughs> I'm too slow. There, but then I end up getting hit. So I'm not quite sure that's a good thing, but oh, we got it. <gasps> cool. Oh, that was hectic. That was hectic. No, nope, I don't need you to come along, along right now. Oh, I need a break. <laughs> okay, but well, that was cool. What is this thing? Uh, I wonder if it's something we're going to be able to do with something with later. Well, I guess we're going to try and break this. I got six coins and some sapphires and stuff. 
And there we go. And... Okay, we've got some more coins. So I wonder if they are going to respawn. I think we're going to have to try and come back here later and see if uh, we're full on limestone. If we are going to... If these guys... It is bigger than this one, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It is bigger. It's lying further away and it looks... And it's bigger than this, so it's definitely bigger. Otherwise, it should look smaller when it's further away, right? So... Um, it's definitely bigger. Okay, well, I think we're gonna have to try and come back here later and see if these guys respawn, especially the chests. Uh, because if they do, it's a way to... For anyone who doesn't like the, co the dungeon or don't want to spend too much the time in the dungeon, they can get a little bit of stuff from, from this place, right? But they do have to fight, um, fight some much worse enemies to actually get some dark essence. Okay, so let's just equip our torch and then we are gonna leave this place at least for now. And there wasn't anywhere else we could go, right? Oh, I just want to double check before I leave. Uh, some limestone, but I don't have room for it. It's kind of looking here, but no, I don't see any like like flat. Yeah, no, it doesn't look like there's anywhere where you can go out further. Oh man, I've missed so many things when I was running around the edge. <laughs> or many things. Well, I've missed two places. Two places. So far. There might be more. There might be more, but here we go. Ooh. That was hectic. That was very hectic. I think this... Yeah, this is a limestone. If you want the stone, you have to go inland. Uh, let's uh, get a little bit more... ...play. Okay, that one we can't mine. Uh, okay, so here we have definitely can't go out any further here, right? No, can't. We've got a little bit of glass. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so okay, we have the river here. We've definitely been out this way. Yeah, we definitely went out that way. Hmm. Not sure if there's any more. Okay, but what do we need? What is the next thing we need? We need an upgrade for the backpack. So we need 350. I have 176, so I kind of need twice this. I could just go and sell, but I think this is also going to be like 40 or something if we just sell the limestone. I could stock up on clay fully, that would give me another 40, so that would be 80. That's still not quite enough. Uh, we could also, but I kind of prefer turning the stone into this. I don't really want to sell it. Uh, we could stock up on more wood. I don't remember what that sells for. Uh, and then, of course, we could. How is it to... Well, okay, that works just fine. <laughs> Yeah, get some more flowers here. We could sell some of those because we do have some growing, right? We can, of course, also get more going for our farm. Uh, build some more farm plots so that we can, you know, have more growing at a time. That would probably be good. I just have to decide on where I want to put them. Uh, that could definitely be an option. Let's... Oh. Just do this. Mm. And then of course we could just go into the dungeon. But I think I want to go and sell off some stuff first. So that we have room. What can do we get in the dungeon? We get stone. So I definitely don't want to carry too much of that. I don't think we ever get limestone in the dungeon or clay. Um, but I'm thinking it might be nice just to sell that. It will respawn again, right? So... Then we get 80 from that, and then we could just do some other stuff while waiting for it to respawn, and then we can sell another batch, and then we would have enough. Of course, we're also going to get some from, um, from oh, some money. We might get some money from the caves. 
but that seems to be... Then you kind of have to remember where you have broken up some chests and stuff. It, it feels like it's really hard getting money from the dungeon, but maybe we just have to go further past the place that we can repair. So that's definitely going to be our object objective to try and go and repair that next time and just kind, kind of go to where we were last time, I think, where there was two nests and see if I can deal with them with my new axe. Okay, there we go. We're 240. Another 10 and we have a full stack of clay. More limestone. This bridge seems to be just something that will get accessible later. I won't be able to pick up all of this, but let's just see if we can get a full stack. I think that's the plan. Yep, full on clay. At least we also got that. You have to kind of notice that. Actually, I think sometimes I miss it that it drops sapphires because it's just a tiny bluish uh, kind of drop next to it. Ooh, then there was... A th no, this was... Yeah, abandoned lumber cottage. So this one we can't break down. Uh, there's more clay over there, but I think we are just gonna head back this way. I'm trying to remember where I am. Okay, so we have kind of a river here. Okay, this looks kind of like home. Yes, it is home. Look at that. We have stuff to harvest. And uh, let's harvest this and this. Uh, I want to have this before I sleep because I don't know if that makes a difference that they will stop glittering and I don't want to risk that because they do seem to do that sometimes so there we go let's do that but I'd rather plant these in the morning I'm uh, not sure I can do this without hitting the other stuff around here so let's just do it like that it's pretty fast anyway and then we're gonna grab all our blueberries here Oh, look at that. We have 106, and of course we need to replant. But, there we go. Let's do that, and then we are just going to sleep. Yay, and it's a new day. Let's uh, get these harvested as well. Get you. Uh, no, they're not glittering. And these, we haven't done anything yet. Okay, I think we are just going to plant more blueberries here. We're going to plant some grapes. Some grapes. We are going to over here plant plant oh did i not say plant all i guess i didn't and there we go cool lots and lots of blueberries and there and then uh we're gonna plant more of these so now we have like 37 of those okay they are not at the same size yet hmm okay well let's see how many blueberries do i have now 58. See, it's kind of weird. It just... We have to do that to have 25 down here. But at least we have 41 surplus. So that's cool. And then I just want this. Yep. Let's make sure to water everything. Go over here. And that they don't need watering, but this does. And... Got some stuff here that needs watering. Cool. And you. Yes. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let's do that. And then I was thinking. I was thinking, what if I wanted to make... A few more of these. Do Put one there. And there I'm going to have to get some more... Uh, wood before we get into the dungeon though uh, but okay that's all we can do I have enough that I could make this okay so let's start planting more of this stuff right so I'm gonna plant some more of these plant some more of these nice and let's just do that I know we could water one more time but do it like this. Can I get back up again? <laughs> Why is it too high? Nope, there we go. Got it. Whew. Okay, now we have more flowers growing as well because it seems like they might be a way of making some money 
Okay, it's a little less time consuming to do this than running around trying to grind out um, stone and wood and all that stuff, right? Uh, in that you will have to wait for them, of course, but I don't have to do much. I just have to water them and then they grow. So in that sense, it's less time consuming. Uh, but of course, you still have to wait for them. So let's see. I need... Just always bring this with us in case we end up running around. I just keep forgetting to equip my torch when I'm out and about. That's a bad habit. Okay, so let's go over here. Make ourselves some more monies. Yep. Just like so. And... But was there anywhere where we could... Oh, maybe it's the pirate guy. Maybe I was over here somewhere at the ship. Was that where we could? Yeah, that's where I didn't look. I was, I was looking over by the blacksmith and stuff, but uh, where was that? That was further down here, maybe. Oh, it's over there, I think. Oh, there's more blueberries right here. Let's steal some of those while we're here anyway. I know this one isn't fully grown, but there we go. Let's just grab it. And then we are going to go over here. Hmm. I just want to see what they sell for. Pretty sure it was... Yes. Okay, so they sell for four each. Which means I would have to sell... There doesn't seem to any be any bonuses. I didn't quite check, but I don't think so. I don't think there's any bonuses. So we would have to sell... 10 of them to get 40 um, so you we would have to test how much we get out of melting a stack of clay uh, I don't it's not something I'm gonna do right now but that would definitely be something to do if you wanna do it mostly most efficiently then you would want to mine a full stack of clay right so if I just fill this up you 250 then i get oh i thought i get got uh 40 for it the last time i was here didn't i thought i did thought i did uh, didn't i get a bonus for this thought i get that so 50 yes then it jumps to 6 12 18 to 24 and then to 30 yeah okay so i guess i just got 50 i thought i got 40 but that means it's like what is that eight sapphires seven sapphires or something to get 30 and then we would have to try and refine all of like a full stack and see how many sapphires we get out of it and you know if we get more than we would get uh, and sell those and then see if we get more than we would get here but anyway let's just Let's just sell this for now. And then I also have a lot of limestone and... Well, there's also glass, but I haven't really... Because you could also sell that somewhere. Yes. Uh, I think. I think I saw it somewhere, but I don't. Uh, that's just... Uh, that's metal, that's iron, that's coal. Hmm. I feel like we saw some glass somewhere. I don't remember where it was. Well, it doesn't really matter. Let's try and do this. And that's probably going to sell for 30 as well then. Uh, okay, do I not have a full stack? I guess I don't. So, let's just sell that. Anyway, just wanted to get a little bit of monies. Uh, we do have a lot of stone, but I'd rather refine that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I need more co uh, wood before we go into the... Before we go into the dungeon, I am thinking I do want to save up for that backpack though, but need another 100 and something for it. So what do we have? Let's buy five of those. We have the watermelons, right? Uh, we have the grapes. Uh, let's just buy five wheat for the time being. I just want to kind of see if I can get some of this started fairly soon. We're going to buy five bananas. 
This would be blueberries. Uh, these we need the lettuces for. Let's just buy five of those. And not sure how the bananas work. I'm sure you can't grow nine of those in one of those planters. Ooh, okay, so here we can sell the bread. So that's five for one bread. But I assume you're gonna need a bunch of wheat to actually make this, plus the entire process. But sometimes it's also a matter of if you really want to spend the time that it takes to make something into something else before selling it. It might sometimes just be easier just to sell the plain resource because it feels faster. Um, though it will give you more money if you process it. Okay, so we have... The only thing we don't have yet is flour, which we need a mill for. And uh, then we need a stone to make this, right? And we still need to find some light stones, but I we have to go deeper in the cave for that, clearly. Hmm. Okay, so let's just... But let's see if anything has finished uh, growing over here. But I think otherwise the plan is definitely to hurt. Now I'm forgetting to eat again. There we go. At least whatever I have to eat works with, you know, filling up my health. So that's a good thing. Mm, yeah. There's also limestone over there. But let's leave it for now. And let's see... Could Ooh, we have some stuff that needs watering now. Just grab you. Go in here. Do -do -do. Didn't I just water these? Did I forget to water them? Oh no, that was these ones, the new ones, right? Yes. Okay, so we have a bunch of stuff growing there. And then I wanted to see if I have enough to make a lattice. No, I need wood for it. Okay. Do -do. Let's put you in here. Okay, well, I guess I am going to get some wood because we are going to need it and probably cut down some of these um, rocks here as well. So I have more stone that I can melt. And then I am going to... I should just cut it down on the other side because then it doesn't fall down that way. <laughs> I keep... Doing it from the one wrong side. Okay, let's grab this. Uh, yep. And let's remember to do this because otherwise I am gonna fuck it. I don't know if we need any stone for the bridge in that dungeon, but we should be able to easily get more stone there. So I think I'm just gonna do that. Let's just leave them in here. And then I wanted to build more of these. So, actually, why would you not? Oh, there we go. Now you do. Okay, so where do I want to make another one of those? I'm thinking maybe at the end here. Because then we can get some passion fruit going. Mm. And then I have to figure out what I want to do here. I don't know if we can maybe put another one, but this is kind of can't really put anything there. I guess we could put... I guess we could put these. But then we need... Uh, I don't think you can put these at this level. Uh, because we can't put walls below here. You can put them above, but you can't... I don't think you can put them below. Can you? No, it doesn't seem like it. Hmm... So I can't really put anything there because this is... Well, I can put these. Why can't I put those there when I can't put these ones? Uh, I guess they don't reach down as far. I can put the foundations here just fine. But not those. I know I can't build one right now of these, but I would think they would be the same height as a foundation. Hmm, okay, I'm gonna have to try that again once we have the resources to make these and see if I can actually put them, because I'm pretty sure we couldn't uh, when we were trying last time. Uh, but otherwise, we're probably just gonna put foundations here and then, I don't know, if we're gonna build a little thing out here uh, or we will, we can just make some of the small ones so maybe we'll put more of these lattices out there or something. I don't know, we'll see. 
there we go we got 43 and i think i'm just gonna add a bit more of this and then i'm gonna get some wood before we go into the dungeon i think that's gonna be the plan next time guys so uh, that was it for today but man that was hectic with those uh, big monsters over on the other island oh i actually wanted to check that oh they have look at that there's one right there and then the other one is probably there too uh, okay, so you could just go back here. Okay, they, they're gonna come and get me here probably, but what I wanted to see was... Yeah, okay, but all the chests are gone. There are no chests. I don't know if they are gonna respawn eventually, uh, but you can go back and kill these guys, that's for sure. Uh, if you want to uh, have fun with that, or if you want some goodies from them, but then I think it's easier just to go into the dungeon and kill some of the the second biggest right and get some of those dark essences i think the little one drops them too but i get a, have a feeling you get more from the from the bigger ones in the dungeon um but unless the chests respawn here later then i, I don't see a point of going there uh, anymore but anyway i just wanted to check if they actually came back and especially if the chests came back but they didn't so uh, that's it for today, guys. Uh, thank you for watching, and as always, uh, do take care, and happy gaming!